Hey everyone and welcome back to Hoffman Engineering. This is the year of Baby Yoda, obviously the star of the Mandalorian web series. While browsing Thingiverse, I found this Baby Yoda in a Santa outfit designed by DMAG24. The 3D model is amazing, so let's turn it into a Christmas tree topper to bring joy to the world. DMAG24 licensed the model under Creative Commons with a no derivatives clause, which means if we modify or remix the model, we can't redistribute it. However, it is really easy to turn a model into a Christmas tree topper in less than a minute, so let me show you how you can do it yourself. The only program you need is Mesh Mixer, a free program by Autodesk. Once installed, open up the model in Mesh Mixer. Select the Mesh Mix option, look under Primitives, and find the cone. We'll use this cone to cut out the hole in the bottom of the model for the tree. Drag the cone into the scene, and now use the arrows to move the cone into the center of the model. And use the boxes to scale the cone's size. Once you have the cone in the right location, hold the shift key and select the Yoda and then the cone in that order. Then select the Boolean difference option. This will subtract the second model from the first model, effectively cutting the cone out of Yoda. Sometimes this operation will leave a messy bottom surface, so you may want to clean it up by using the plain cut option in the edit menu. Just move it down to where you want to cut and you'll end up with a nice flat surface. And we're done. We're now ready for 3D printing. I exported the model from Mesh Mixer and opened it up in Cura. I scaled the model to 150 millimeters tall, which is just under six inches. There are overhangs for the arms, ears, and ball of the hat, so I made sure to enable supports. I used the support blocker feature to make sure that the very tips of the ears don't get supports, as I don't think they'll need them. I printed it with a 0.2 millimeter layer height on my TiVo Tornado, which has a 0.6 millimeter nozzle. It has an 8% gyroid infill just to give some of the interior surfaces some support. Overall, it took 10 hours and 22 minutes to print. As you can see, the final print has some support failures on one of the ears. Luckily, those ears didn't really need the supports, so it didn't affect the final prints. Once off the print bed, you can take a pair of pliers and remove the support materials. Take care when removing the supports around the fragile fingers though, you don't want to harm the print. And there we go, a perfect print for the top of the Christmas tree. I really liked the way that this turned out, and the green filament was perfect for Baby Yoda. So thank you all for watching, and I hope you learned just how easy it is to turn any 3D model into a Christmas tree topper using Mesh Mixer. I have a link to DMAG24's Baby Yoda in the description if you want to give it a try yourself. I also have links to the 3D printers and filament I used. And thank you to my patrons for helping support the channel. I'm looking forward to an awesome 2020. If you would like to give the Christmas gift which keeps on giving, become a patron at patreon.com slash hoffmanengineering. Not only do you get special perks, but your support helps keep this channel going. So I hope you all have a happy holidays, and I'll see you all next time.